sorry for the wait, everybody. I am, once again, your androgynous AI game show host from the future, Caster. And uh, Rafi is just away from the call for the moment. I'm sure they'll introduce themselves properly once again when they return. But this is the Neon Caster Twitch channel, and I am wrapping up. <laughs> Finally, the last little bit of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Um, last time we uh, got the new Paradox Legends and uh, showed that moody teen what's what. We caught Terrapagos after what a, a genuinely quite difficult raid boss fight. And uh, now we are clearing up the last little bits and pieces of story uh, before we can uh, put shut to the story of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. There are apparently some bits and pieces to uh, tie up uh, separate to the new uh, epilogue storyline, which I will just work my way through. I believe Rafi has seen all these bits and pieces, so I'm just going to uh, get going and Rafi will join when they're back at the table. Costa, you have my thanks for all you have done to help the League Club and to help Kieran. Once you become champion, Kieran withdrew himself entirely from our ranking system. I th though I consider this somewhat sad, it is not as if he it is not <laughs> it is not as if he and I can no longer meet. More than anything, I am glad he seems to be acting like his former self once more. Indeed, I have swept up I have been swept up in joy to such an extent that I have prepared a tremendous amount of flight enabling supplement. Aha, I have prepared a tremendous amount of the flight enabling supplement used in my trial. Please feed your Agias an appropriate portion of it whenever you wish to fly. Yas. What? You want to fly right now? But please slow down. The supplement was never meant to be eaten in such large... Maridon can now just fly. It would seem your Agias has powered up somehow. From the looks of it, I would guess that it has gained the power to fly whenever you wish it to. Well, I suppose this is an acceptable outcome. As it happens, there is a super hard course for my flying time trial. For me, you may attempt it upon clearing the hard course. Feel free to do so whenever you are ready. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Time for me to go. So long then. Mm -hmm. So we can now fly whenever we like. That's cool. There was another... Ah, yes. Speaking to Mr. Serrano. Oh, yeah, because I set the Lavincia music to play in here, that's right. Well, there you are, Caster. Just the person I was looking for. I heard the news. You're the new BB League champion, am I right? <laughs> I admit, I'm blown away. Inviting you to this academy was the best decision I've made recently. So, now that you've had some time to get comfortable here, how do you find Blueberry Academy? Are you having fun? I love it here, sure. Good, good, just what I like to hear. Anyway, there's a small favor I'd like to ask of you, Rafter. You see, this whole academy has become so much more lively and energetic since you came here. And that got me thinking, maybe we should have even more people to come visit from Paldea. Have them come as special coaches or something. You know a lot of people, right? You got lots of friends and everything? I mean, like, teachers from your school, gym leaders, that sort of thing. Oh, and any strong friends of yours are also welcome here. 
<laughs> if someone say strong friends. A strong uh, friend has arrived. Welcome back. My, I am terribly sorry for the wait. I had one of those one of those things that I come up where it's like beyond my control. Just gotta take care of it, and I am here now, like Neil Green. Not a worry, not a worry. All right, spoken like a true champion. I knew you were the right person to ask. I got the uh, fly forever cheat from uh, the the steel gym leader. Ah um, uh, yes, my my favorite uh, Korean MMO. Fly yeah, for yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you can use the club room computer to contact anyone you want to invite. Well, oh, but it will cost BP. We'll need to pay for their trip and such. Here's some to get you started. Just assuming I'm straight broke, huh? I think I'll arrange for the special coaches to stay in this club room when they're not teaching. Uh, you should have a chat with them while they're here. Now then, I'll leave it to you. Enjoy. <laughs> All right. Did you bother uh, summoning a person? I I, I know that the, the, those two things were marked as for me to speak to. I know that there's like a side quest person to speak to that unlocks all the old legendaries to be found around the map, but I don't think that's the thing necessary to do on camera. Yeah, no, I haven't found that guy. I'm, I'm not sure where he is. Uh, Snackworth, I think his mm. name is maybe Snacksworth, but mm. um, I did invite some people, but it, it just, uh, I, I would say don't worry about it too much now. Mm -hmm. um, it's uh like seems like a, a fun little thing but it's more of like you know oh yeah you can do a rematch and maybe mm. see a couple character interactions and that kind of thing mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that's the thing i can do on my own time no worries i don't think i even did all of the school stuff <laughs> before so i should probably like finish this <laughs> Yeah, no, you and me both. The, the game did not exactly uh, say strongly incentivize that. Mm. Apparently, um, there's a lot of character info that you can get. Like you find out a lot about those characters, but uh, yeah, it felt no prompting to do so. Like the the maths teacher Lime is Rhyme's sister, uh, and they have oh, yeah, things to I, say I to each that. other about that and things like that. I'm like, that's cute. I have not interacted with this. I, I sent you the room code, by the way. Ooh, yes, okay. Let me, let me, haha, <laughs> what a code. Oh, I need to be, I need to be out in the grand blue yonder to be able to use the room code, okay. While you're getting that up, happy birthday to, at least to your operator. Thank um, you. I mentioned that on the, um, previously we were just at the, uh, you know, for, for the uh, tabletop bundle stream, mm -hmm. mention that a little bit. Uh, third of the way to a uh, <laughs> level cap of 99. Congratulations. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, for a bird like myself, you know, 33, uh, most of us do not make it that long, and that's for sure. Mm -hmm. um, but for a, a digital consciousness like you, I mean, that must be very different. You know, you you all seem to barely last years, at least, you know, for working at Google, so... Yeah, planned um, obsolescence is a hell of a drug. <laughs> I mean, hey, we can still use JPEGs, so... Mm, at the very, uh, I, I guess, uh, going by the prevailing wisdom of uh, previous AIs in a similar position to me, uh, while the time in operation is maybe low, because we think on si several cycles per second uh the amount of reality time spent thinking is longer than uh humans so in a way our age is is measured in a different way i think like um i guess it's like how dog years work right they they have a they have a lifespan but they that 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 process is accelerated compared to humans right mm hmm Or is this well, even gonna put I us? hope your hard drive doesn't burn out uh, too <laughs> soon at all. Don't you go defragging on me all the time. Uh, no, you know, I'm I'm backed up in at least seven different places as well. <laughs> Tell me about it. Why do you think I was late? <laughs> um, let's see. You mean Artisan? Yeah, <laughs> I remember the names of these towns. <laughs> Saying hi to the... Uh... Okay, so that was... Do each of these? Oh, oh man, I was really hoping because it's been so long since I've been here. I was really mm -hmm. hoping like, do each of these Sunflora statues have a different name? 
Because seeing like this one is surrendering Sunflora, is hoping Hurt everyone will be like, saluting Sunflora. <laughs> he has a single work. So uh, yeah, where, where do we need? What, what do we need to do aside from getting yeah, flight? First, uh, there was that event where we got the um, a very special petra berry. Mm -hmm. From the um, mystery gift, I did that already. Yeah, let's go to Kitakami at the community center okay. and find out what the deal with that is. I do not know. I know it is tied to a Pokemon that we don't have yet, but past that, I couldn't tell you. I do know what that Pokemon looks like, but I don't know much more about it than that. I, I know what its ability is, and I know that it is not, uh, shall we say, revolutionizing the competitive scene. Huh, that's funny. I, I don't know if this is... Uh, Technically something we should wait until after the epilogue to do, but I feel like I would rather let the epilogue be the epilogue rather than mm -hmm. be like, ah, oh, the epilogue, and then the epilogue's epilogue, <laughs> the post credit stinger. No, this makes sense. I, I, I actually had assumed that the uh, Petra Berry arc was functionally the epilogue, like it guides you to the end game, but uh, who knows? Okay, no, this is just see. a shop. Um, but like... Oh, maybe I have to buy the Petra Berry from her? Oh, maybe. I'm looking around behind and there isn't uh, mm. something here. I no. mean, I think we have the Petra Berry in, in our, our inventory. inventory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When, when there was a promotional, there was like a promotional video put on YouTube from Nintendo about this. And they showed this corner store. So I was like, oh, oh, okay. Is it to do with that? But uh, maybe it's inside the community center, like the... That's possible. I'm gonna I'm gonna look this up real fast, mm -hmm. um, and because it is it is possible this may indeed be epilogue to epilogue. Mm. Um, let's see. What was the name of the item? It's called it's called something like the perfect Petra Berry or something. Yeah, it'll be in our key items, won't it? The mythical Petra Berry. Ah, of course. It is said that a Petra Berry tree carefully tended by an expert gardener will produce just one of these berries every few years. Uh, uh, you need to interact with a decoration at Peachy's. Oh, right. There is like a, a purple like fruit on the counter. Like here. Ah, so there is. Yeah, here we go. There's a dusty old decoration of some sort mixed in with all the daily goods and things, and it smells incredibly sweet. Looks like the toxic chain. Hmm. The decoration appeared to move a little bit. Hey, what's up? Oh, I've not used this voice in a while. <laughs> I still regret giving him this snooty bitch boy voice, considering how <laughs> kind he was in the grand scheme of things. Rafter, yo, Arvin here. I heard the news. You've been having all kinds of big adventures, huh, little buddy? School trips and studying abroad, what luck? Yeah, it's been awesome. Yeah. I got to play in doubles format. <laughs> Yeah, man, I'm just jealous to hear that. I wish I could go along too. Now that I think about it, it's one crazy thing after another since you came to our school. I guess you've been real busy lately, but are things starting to settle down? I was thinking that if you have the time, and only if you want, of course, maybe, you could come. I could come visit you at your house? Of course, come right over. Seriously? It's such a relief to hear you say that. And, with the, and without even the tiniest hesitation. I mean, I've not been back to my house in months, so... Um, right. So, I guess I'll I come over. What it looks like. Your house is in Cabapoco, right? I like that the dialogue reminds us where our house <laughs> right. is, knowing that we have not been there in months. <laughs> I'll meet you out front. I'll see you there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's uh, a Splatoon episode, I understand. <laughs> We're getting gooped. 
Okay, to Cabo Poco we go. Mm -hmm. All the way to the south. Your house. No, no, I... Yeah. There we go. Just mix worldwide over here. <laughs> oh, I see Ooh, Penny. You, you got the big load. All right, that's me. Mm -hmm. There they are. Hi, Raptor. <laughs> Figured I'd tag along. Hey there. You're all here. Cluster, I... Raptor, I... This is all my fault, sorry. You know, when I called you and I said I wanted to come hang, well, these two overheard and... Well... We weren't just going to let you hog the chance to visit Rafter. It's way more funner altogether. You say that, but who wants a bunch of uninvited guests? That's just rude. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I guess if you're fine with it, Rafter, then I can't really complain either. Okay, listen up, you two. You two chuckle fucks, sit down and listen. <laughs> Listen up, fives. The ten is speaking. Uh, <laughs> we're not allowed to call. <laughs> Arvin's ten years old. <laughs> uh, we're, we're not allowed to cause any trouble for Rafter and their mom. Got it? We're going to be the perfect guests today. Ah, you bet. I don't know why you think why. I don't know who you think you're educating here, but sure, whatever. Ah, that was such a great meal. Can't believe we got all that after we barged in out of nowhere. Your mom's cooking is so good, Ralph. Right? And she's so pretty. My brain literally glitched when I saw her. Okay, Penny. <laughs> it just, just continues to be maximum lesbian feelings, huh? I'm so glad she remembered me. And look at this huge room. It doesn't make you feel all boxed in like the dorm rooms do. It's super cute, seriously. Almost too much for me to take. Ah, oh, it's a Nintendo Switch. You have to tell me what games you've got on this thing. You've got games on your phone, says Penny. Um... <laughs> I love this squabbit plush. This plus to die for. Also, yeah, I I like the fact I unintentionally um, voiced that penny line, just <laughs> just reinforcing uh, <laughs> when gamer genes activated, she became a different person. Uh -huh. um, uh, sure, you can be mom. How's everybody doing? Anyone want dessert? Me. I was thinking of bringing up some sweets. Oh, me, me, me! I want dessert. <laughs> sweets, yes. N no way. We couldn't possibly ask you for more food. We don't mean to be a hustle. Hassle, I mean, we don't want to be a hassle. <laughs> oh, sweetie, no need to stand on ceremony here. Just make yourselves at home and relax. Relax. I yes, ma'am. <laughs> Immediately oh. not relaxing. Oh, and uh, Raptor, a letter came from you. For you, even. It's from... Kai Iran. Do you know what kind you're in? Uh, Furryman022 asks, is Zeroark in this game? <laughs> First time chatter, Furryman022. <laughs> Asking the big questions. Listen, it's important to know what you're about. Uh, Zoroark also, yes. Is indeed, Zoroark is indeed technically in this game. As, as well as the Hisuian <laughs> variant. <laughs> oh, uh, I yeah, mean... I mean... What they're about and they're taking no fucking quarter. Holy shit, okay. Uh, question <laughs> answered. Yes. Uh, s s slow your roll, first time chatter for Mano 22, but thank you for joining us. <laughs> we do indeed... I... No, no, he's gone through his arc. I'm not going to say I don't know her. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Unfortunately, Zorok is not very competitively viable, so I don't think either of us have been the intention of using them. Uh, My word, you've been making plenty of friends. Is the ghost, you is the ghost normal one maybe useful? Uh, I don't know if either of them are especially um, useful, but um, it's certainly better. Certainly better. Hmm. I'll bring those sweets up in just a few. I hope you all enjoy them. Now come help. Hmm. I mean, uh, okay, 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 uh, okay. A little too on the nose, bud. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the it's 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 funny when you're not being direct. <laughs> Anyway, Penny ran off uh, to continue to thirst after my own mother. Uh, your, your mom sure is nice, Rafter. You're real lucky. Oh, but what about that letter? Aren't you at least going to open it up? Oh, um, yeah, this is, um, Karen. And in a slightly higher register. Okay, we got it. Dear Rafter, how are you doing lately? I took a leave from school, so... I'm back in Mossowy Town for a while. My sis came back with me too. I know we didn't get much chance to talk after everything that happened in the Underdeaths. I'd really like to catch up. Think you could swing a visit to Kitakami? Kamine would love to see you. I'm sure maybe you could bring your friends from Paldea too. I included plenty of tickets. Who's this Karen guy? Some new friend or something? He sounds very desperate. Ah, ah, the ellipsis. Yes. Yeah, he's a, a friend. <laughs> What's with the weird hesitation? Is there some kind of story there? Not that it's my business. Also, we, we have seen Flamigo. Uh, this We're in the epilogue of the game, so we have seen just about everything except for what's come out in the past uh, week or so yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> no uh I, I guess that's an important thing to highlight if you have not played scarlet and violet at all before and you don't want spoilers on content as much as i love having you here this is not the stream for that this yeah. is this is fully spoiler territory now <laughs> raptor arvin you are not gonna believe how good this stuff looks there's too much to carry upstairs. Come on down here and eat. Sheesh, that did Mona. Hasn't she ever heard of an inside voice? But I guess we better go, or she'll no, keep no, on Nimona's shouting. Nimona's all about that paranormal hyper voice. <laughs> it's a very nice home, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my poor gut. I feel like a bust. I feel like I'll burst if I eat another bite. I think what you're trying to say is thank you so much for feeding us. It was all really delicious, right? Ivan <laughs> is like, I don't have any parents, and y <laughs> how dare you not be grateful? Mm -hmm. I love the dishes and stuff. Uh, aren't you the sweetest thing? But no need to lift a finger. You kids just take it easy. Thanks, man. You're the best. You're even better than my mom. <laughs> Who is consistently not around, as I understand. Um, at least Nimona's got manners. I'll give her that. Unlike this one. Oh, they still don't actually like each other after all of this. <laughs> That's quite funny. <laughs> huh? You're looking at me? Say, so, Rafter, about that latter. What was that place your new pal mentioned? Kitakami or something? You really going to meet this Kieran guy again? Let's go together. Wait, what? You going somewhere? Oh yeah, because she was confirmed to be from Galar, so she definitely has a British accent. Oh, uh, right. Oh, um... Did we miss something? Something good? Spill it. Just fully shaking him by the shoulders. Are you serious? We're definitely going with you. I mean, I'm not disappointed because I thought it was like, you know, a new build that could, you know, instantly uh, take care of top specs even after it's gotten up like several stacks of. But no, no, this is fine too. This is fine too. <laughs> <laughs> this Kieran kid was champion of a super elite battle academy, right? I've gotta meet him. More like I've got to battle him. Yes. 
<laughs> was it that obvious? I feel kind of bad, though. We just invited ourselves along on your trip without asking. The guy said to bring friends, and we're those friends. He even sent tickets for us. Yep. Friends equals us. There go, we get the tickets. You bet we do. This will be my first time going on a trip with friends. It's kind of scary and exciting at the same time. Yeah, now that you mention it, I don't think I've taken the trip with a friend either. You're kidding. Oh, this is gonna be amazing. So get excited. Guess I better at least tell the housekeeper over at my place I'll be away for a while. Why don't we break for now, do whatever prep we gotta do, and uh, meet up again later. Sounds good. Well, let's say we meet up again in front of Mesagos's southern gate. Roger. I'll see you all later then. Thumbs up. Yosh. <laughs> Thanks for having Thanks us over. For having us over. Oh, did Nimona and the others leave already? I was about to demonstrate an interesting character trait. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> Your friends are all such nice kids. I was really glad to meet them all. Now it sounds like you're all about to go have a little adventure together, hmm? Well, have fun if you do. No fighting, and be sure to look after one another. Well, they will absolutely be fighting. <laughs> yeah. I, I am kind of disappointed that we're on, like, we are so many games deep into this series, and every mother in these games is just like, that's me, the domestic idol. Mm. Like, I, Dads have might... occasionally been around to do more, but I guess it's just Norman. Uh. Yeah, it's like, I would almost prefer a total absentee, like just mm. the character is not in the story, to um, another like, oh, that's me. I'm the stereotypical housewife. Mm -hmm. I'm good at cooking and I'm attractive. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, like, I don't know. At, at least, uh, what's the name of uh, the Battle Network mom? Oh, Haruka. Yeah, at, at least uh, Haruka has some, like, she gets some character moments, at mm. least, even if she does not break that far out of that mold. No, she, she's good at keeping um, Yurichiro, is the dad? Yurichiro? Yeah, Yurichiro, uh, yeah. Yeah, keeping him in line. <laughs> There's a couple of instances where she's like, eat food, or I swear to God, you, ca you cannot just stay in Scilab for two days straight with no food. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Hey, over here, over here. All right, Rafter, just load up on travel snacks. Your bag full, of, sorry, your bag full of grub. Oh my gosh, Dad. Oh, okay. Would you just drop it? I told you, friends. I'm going with friends. No, you don't need to be worried about it. We are perfectly capable of taking care of ourselves. Ugh, no, it's not going to be an advent tour. No one says that. Honestly, I'm hanging up now. You know, I saw a theory earlier today that um, Penny's dad is Peony. Because um, huh. apparently Peony also says advent tour. Um, yeah, I mean, Peony, I guess, has two kids. Yeah. Also, she's mad pale to be Peony's kid. He, he is incredibly <laughs> pale. It's, a, it's kind of like a, hmm... I think maybe the dad is a colleague of Peony, maybe, and that's kind of that this rubbed off. I mean, off. it may also just be this is a thing um, that some uh, dads and Galar say. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Certainly, I'm too tired for any of this. Did he you came get to this with one spoon? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get your old man's okay to go? Yeah, in the end, but I had to put up with his ultra mega annoying dad talk to do it. Also, apparently, ultra mega annoying dad is something that uh, Peony's other daughter calls him. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it's just it's it's just a fun little reference for the people who are paying attention. I guess. Personally, I think in this generation, it should have been he, um, my Terra annoying dad. Huh. I I think g genuinely, if we have to go and put a head cannon on it, they went to the same school before P before Penny transferred to. Um, uh, to Paldea, I think is probably 
the most sensible thing. That's fun. Um, because I, I do like it when the different realms connect up. The Grimsley, the dark type Elite Four member from Gen 5, where he goes on a gambling binge and then is just kind of seen on holiday in um, Alola, just in a robe, <laughs> just yes, stolen. <laughs> I love that. Uh, what a king. He just ultra mega cares, little bird. Oh, oh, yeah, maybe you're right. <laughs> okay, we've all got permission and we're all here. No one forgot anything, right? Then vamos, let's go. Let's go. Let's, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, just, uh, you didn't forget that this is, uh, kind of Spain, right? <laughs> vamos in there, so you wouldn't forget. Hmm. I mean, I guess, I guess that consistently happens. There's a lot of wayward French in X and Y. Yeah. Oh, so this is Masui Town? Mm. Y'all smell that, right? Sm kind of smells different than Paldea. Mm. Uh, my head's still spinning too fast to see anything. I'll be there yet. Maybe you shouldn't. Maybe you wouldn't have gotten so sick if you and stared at your phone the whole bus ride. No. But I didn't know if we'd get signal here. I had to load up on internet goodies while I could. Just, is she just downloading memes during mm. the entire flight? Why, hello there. Hiya. Hiya, indeed. I'm the caretaker here. It's a pleasure to welcome you to our town. Kieran had mentioned you Can I touch your coming. head? No! Do I look like a petting zoo to you, young lady? I thought it'd be lucky, I don't know. After a side, this is everyone's first time visiting Kizakami, is that right? Interesting we can say no, I think. It's gotta be yes, though. Hmm. Yeah, that's the long and short of it. I see, I see. Well, again, you're most welcome. You can all s you can sleep here at the community center. All the rooms have been freshened up for you. Oh, it's a package holiday. Or it's just like the community center is just like a hostel. Hmm. Well, now that's some thoughtful service. <laughs> it was no trouble. Now please relax and enjoy yourselves. But most of all, enjoy Kizakami. Thanks very much, sir. So what about that Kieran guy? Have you heard from him at all? Excuse me? He doesn't have a smartphone? How is this kid even alive? He must not want any distractions from training. Think he's at his house? Should we go meet him? I've not processed the fact that he doesn't have a smartphone. No, actually. me neither. That kind of feels like news. I mean, I, I'm sure it told us, but uh, that just fell straight out of my skull. Mm -hmm. I had considered trying to fly over to the house. I was like, that's not necessary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we still got the new hairstyle. After. Oh, man. Uh, it's been a long time. <clears throat> Settling into an American accent for Kieran specifically. Rafter. Oh man, it's been a long time. No, it's not there. We'll get it. We'll fall into it. I trust you. It is It is funny to me, the idea of like, I ah, yes, Kitakami, California. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm like the protagonist or what have you. There we go. We got it. Um, nice. Thanks so much for coming. Sorry I couldn't have come meet you at the bus stop. Things have been crazy at home. It's great to see you. <laughs> Thanks. But wait, did you come all by yourself? Yo, we're here too. My dialogue does not match up with the tone of voice at all. 
<laughs> nice, nice to meet you. I'm Nimona. You're Kiri, yeah? Raffy told, Raftor told us all about you, like how you're great at Pokemon battles. <laughs> right? Well, well, I don't know about that, but... What? Are you bad? Do you suck? Are you... <laughs> are you... Are you a scrub? Dial it back a notch or nine. You're scaring him. I'm Penny. I'm like a certain someone, I'm fine with taking friendships nice and slow. And I'm Arvin. Caster's... Rafter's absolute best... <laughs> absolute best friend. Sticking your claim right from the get-go, huh? Well, I'm Kieran. I'm uh, mm, protagonist. Uh, uh, no, it's 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 no, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. My head is not in it today. It's fine. I met Rafter <laughs> when he came here for that school trip. That's when we became friends. Um, what else? Oh, I'm a student at Blueberry Academy. Uh, I mean, I was a student there. I'm on break right now. Whoa, really? I, I know how that goes. Same thing happened to me. Penny, don't go sympathizing with the enemy. <laughs> I, thought this, I thought I could count on you to at least keep this interloper at arm's length. Eh, I just get the feeling we're pretty alike. Oh, well, your friends seem like a quirky group. Not like you are. Uh. Anyway, a friend of Rafter's is a friend of mine. I hope you all had a good. I I hope you all had a good time staying at Kitakami. Thanks. Now let's battle. I uh, what? That space in front of the community center looks like a good battle spot. Vamos, come on. D does she want me to go battle with her? How am I supposed to go battle her? <laughs> yup, go have fun. Knock yourself out, kid. Oh man. She's just as pushy as sis is, but like, different. Oh no, I think I might have made a terrible mistake. This Kieran kid might actually be a good guy. Of course he is. He's friends with Rafter. Y yeah, that's true. You must really hate me, don't you? Okay, there we go. We've got the catchphrase for it. We've got the phrase. The help. The, uh, uh, voice actors actually do that relatively often. It's like an accent or whatever character voice that's difficult to do. You find a phrase that you say that helps you fall into it. Uh, so I, I think you must really hate me, don't you? Uh, is is definitely Kieran's. Um, I told you the foot letter story, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Sam, well, S Sam told me herself. Uh, okay, good. I got completely destroyed. Who the heck is the owner anyway? She's a champion. Oh, oh my god. Twist the knife and say that she's the rival? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad that you're on even keel now, kid, but, uh... You gotta know you ain't the OG. <laughs> You consider her a rival, Rafter? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. She's going so good then. Kieran, you're so good. That was awesome. I wonder you're the champion of that fancy pants school of yours. But, but I couldn't beat you. Does it really matter? Whether you win or lose, Pokemon battles are a blast. That's not what you said last campaign. Well, no, that's true. That is what you said last campaign, but your face didn't show that. Uh... Yeah, that's true. That's Nimona for you. You get used to it. You okay? Feel like running for the hills yet? Hey now, I'm not done with him. Not, not at all. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, <laughs> I really had a lot of fun. See? Were her eyes always that color? Uh, no, no. She has yellow eyes. She has amber eyes, like a uh, like Kieran. Oh, so, yikes! Uh, what the? Yeah. Well, uh -huh. I the, wonder. Who the heck are you, sis? You okay? 
No. No, gee, no, gee. <laughs> wow. Uh, Carmine? Mochi, 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 mochi. Is... <laughs> this your big sister, Kieran? You think she wants in on the battle fund too? There's no way that's what's going on here. <laughs> I'm so sorry, everybody, but could you just uh, help me carry my... Does happen often, Kieran? <laughs> Prone to seizures. Oh, sorry, everybody. Can you just help me just uh just carry my sis somewhere safe? You want us to pick her up and drag her off? I mean, if you say so. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> I'm now suddenly re uh, reminded that uh, last episode we were told that the tone of the epilogue was unexpected. Hmm. You sure you don't want to stay with your sister? She should be okay. Gramps and Grandma will look after her during the day, but they must have taken their eyes off her for just a sec earlier. Sorry it, for making you- Does that you... happening only take a second? How much do you know? Sorry for making you all help out with that. Oh, I mean, it was no big deal. I'd be to help out, but- yeah, I gotta ask. Is everything okay with your sister? She seemed, uh, pretty rolled up. She's not usually like that. Well, that's a relief. I think she just was just really excited to meet you all. You really think that's what that was? Y yeah. Th that's gotta be why she's dancing that weird dance and screaming, Mochi Mochi. Is this a TikTok thing? Mm, how long has she been doing that? Don't tell me she's still doing it inside. I mean, she's been like that ever since I sent you that letter, Rafter. What? She was already dancing and all, but the time I woke up the next day, no explanation. Hey, Yellow King Hunter! Hey, Yellow King Hunter. I guess that really isn't normal, is it? Maybe the other folks in town are right. Maybe this really is a curse. What? Wait, it could be a curse? Curse? <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. This trip just took a real sun dive into horror movie territory. I know zilch about curses, but could uh, something like this have happened before? Either hear, heard of any old stories or legends about it? I know. After I already took care of the whole thing with Ogapon and the Lord Three. Sheesh, Rafter. You already just rolled on through this town like a little hurricane, huh? And my sis may have no filter, and be inconsiderate, and push people's buttons. But I'd still rather see her be her than old that <clears throat> But I'd still rather see her be her old self than whatever this is. Yeah, for sure. If there's anything that if there's anything you think we could do to help, just say the word. What? Sure, we'll help you out. I definitely don't believe in horror movie tropes like curses, anyways. Yeah, let's do this. If we get to battle a curse, I'm so here for it. I love that animation where the ghost Pokemon drives a nail into itself. Oh my Hardcore. god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> you guys sure? You don't mind? Friends help one another. Everybody looks at the camera. <laughs> We're after. No, all of you. Thank you. It's too late to start today, but I'd be real grateful if you could help me out tomorrow. First, we're going to have a proper welcome party at the, tonight at the community center. Aye, aye. Let's do Tell it. Me in. <laughs> Just watching you play in the water feature. Um, wait, you're telling me this isn't a birdbath? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, 
Yeah, with uh, non-reversed controls. Miserable. <laughs> yeah, I kind of wish the controls were reversed, but not a big deal. Mm -hmm. Silent chatting. I got some soda. Congratulations. Sugar and carbonation, my two love languages. You find peaches, all right? Yep, no problem. So close by. There was nobody there, so I just left money in the counter. Do you think I was okay? Oh, yeah. The old lady who runs it steps away sometimes, so everybody does that. No worries. Man, I can't imagine anyone getting away with that back in Paldea. <laughs> Wait, Nimona? That's not all over your mouth. Are you eating snacks without us? When I see a help yourself sign, oh. I don't ignore it. Oh no. <laughs> There's just one mochi left, though. Oh no. Hey, Kieran, do you have any idea how to change your channel on this TV? It just keeps playing the same tourism video over and over. I don't know how to use electronics. <laughs> oh, uh, the caretaker hid the remote somewhere, so that video is all we can get on the TV. Okay, crew, new goal. Find that clicker so we can watch a movie or something. It's got to be around here somewhere, right? We just need to find it. Oh, um, huh. Why am I thinking of that? Probably because you want to respect the caretaker. Time to search this place top to not not my voice. And um, time to search this place top to bottom. And uh, then I vote we get to play games up on that big screen. <laughs> it's like our own little treasure hunt. Everyone, grab a corner and start searching. <laughs> I'm in. Fuck the rules. Get this remote. <laughs> yeah, fuck our caretaker. You agree my plan is genius, huh? I mean, oh, if I was, so like, the 15, 16-year-old that these kids are, I would also try and find the remote. Yeah. How about this, then? Let's say whoever finds the remote gets to decide what we do. Hey, Kieran. No fair getting a head start. Hey, Rotom. Oh, is it in the gender-neutral bathroom? No. It's in the potted planter. I immediately found it. <laughs> what? Go figure. I... There we are. Ah, you mean the one with the sparkle. Mm-hmm. What? No way! That means you get to choose what we do. Wowzers. Because of course you found it first, Rafter. Hey, friend. You agree with me that we should use that big old screen to play games, right? Huh? Where did Nimona go off to? Is she in the bathroom or something? No. I was checking around that area earlier. I'm pretty sure I would have seen her go in. She didn't head to the rooms in the back either. She was by the door to the hallway this whole time. I think I know what's going on. She must be waiting to help to jump out and scare us. <laughs> hmm. I tried her phone. No. I tried her phone, but she's not picking up. Have you tried calling her? I did hear her phone ring or anything. That's weird. Oh. That is weird. So, does that help us figure out where she is? Outside. Ace yeah. Detective! Ooh, yeah, Caster, we have a mystery on our hands. How do you feel? <laughs> Patronizing video game. Uh, <laughs> Detective Pikachu returns looking ass puzzles. Um, maybe, maybe she was so set on finding that remote that she went outdoors to look for it? Well, I guess that would make sense. Maybe she forgot to get something at the shop? I just hope she didn't wander out of town. No, she's she's possessed. C come on now. Um, Kitakami's dangerous at night if you don't know your way around. I think Rafter and I should go look outside. Arvin, Penny, can you two stay here for now? What? But 
What if she comes back while we're all out? We're the better chance of finding her if you stay here and then you can call us if she does. That's true. Okay, be careful out there. We'll hold down the fort till we get back. Let's go, Rafter. I'm sorry that both of your characters are possessed right now. Oh, I was just about to apologize to you for the same thing. Okay, we stepping out. Mm -hmm. I do like that chingling whatever it is. Yeah, a little rice bowl. Huh? There's still some people out. It's hard to tell with the sun down, but I think those are those two are workers from the orchard. Why don't we go ask him if they've seen the Mona? Okay, what? Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a real long shot here that they're gonna sit, uh, open with a word beginning with M. Mm. Excuse us. Oh, 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 oh yeah, no, I can see his eye. Um, hello? <laughs> Something's off about them. Mo. Mo. Chi. Mo. Chi. Mo. Chi. Mo. Chi. Mo. Problems. <laughs> Mo. Mochi mochi! Mochi mochi! Oh, 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 what the heck? What's going on? Was this basically the kid friendly equivalent of a zombie movie? Oh, I think so. Mochi mochi! Mamma mia! Oh god, did they battle you? That's funny. <laughs> Music. I'm into mm. it. Oh, interesting. Mochi mochi. <laughs> Very good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Disco. Although leading on Indeedy is not super useful under this current circumstance. Meanwhile, I just aqua stepped all over Salazzle's face. Mm -hmm. I mean, Psychic is strong against both of them, but... <laughs> I love that they're just kind of mostly just standing in this, like, uh -huh. pose. That's um, right. I think I, I think I saw them go into the uh, mochi dance very briefly. Mm. Ah, uh, it's when they uh, use commands, I see. Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> That's funny. It's oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Level 79. So this is definitely endgame content, but it's not necessarily oh, yeah. more difficult than uh, some of the fights we just did. <laughs> no. Mochi, mochi, mochi. Hi, Yellow King Hunter. Welcome back. How you doing today? Oh my god, they got Yellow King Hunter too. Mochi! Are you out of available Pokemon? Are you done? Noctowl. Oh my god, they got me. Mochi! Mm -hmm. Oh, Slay the Spire! Yeah, 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 yeah. Good fucking game. What is your favorite character play in Soda Spire? Unsurprisingly, mine is the robot. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, if this is supposed to be a zombie movie, I'm going to play that up in the voice acting for these characters Fair. if they're going to. No. No. Ew, that scared the snot out of me. No. Uh, no, Marissa is a modded character that you can play in Slay the Spire. That's great. <laughs> Let's get an end to them. They were perfectly fine when I saw them yesterday. <laughs> what the heck is going on around here? They're acting like Carmine. Mm-hmm. 
How long has it been since Carmine has uh, drank water? <laughs> Is this just what happens when you're dehydrated? <laughs> oh, hey. I was thinking, like, they might be starving. Oh, sure. This, this mm. could be some fucking dancing plague shit. Mm. Hey, you're right. This weird dancing and yelling. It, it's what my sis was doing. Do these two get wrapped up in this whole curse thing, too? The look on their faces like, hmm, mm -hmm. well, mochi, I guess. Oh, man, I can't believe no Mona vanished at a time like this. In the background, you can really use her help. <laughs> there she is. Rougher than the All rest right, of them, the animation. best of them. Tougher than leather. <laughs> sure look like her, all right? She ran off towards Kitakami Hall. Why? Come on, we should go after her. All right, all right. I, yeah. Oh, shit. Check out the NPC on the side who's doing the mochi dance. Um, give me one second. I realized I should probably throw an ability patch at Chroma Dancer. Oh, so you can get like Moxie or what have you. Yeah, you got it. Uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure I got one of those. She has yeah, a bunch of fun go. builds between charge to get eight stacks to double attack damage. Amplify, pay extra mana to make a card stronger, and her own version of the perfect strike build. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Uh, annoyingly, Slay the Spire is one of those games that I really like. Oh, I can't, I can't access the menu while I'm flying, so I do not. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Um, Slay the Spire is one of those games that I enjoy. It's very difficult to get a run where you finish successfully. But also, doing like a three hour stream when no runs get to the end is like a huge bummer. I should play it more though, it's a good ass game. Oh god, I tripped over an Ekans. <laughs> Hello there, Kieran. And you too, Raptor. Grandpa, Grandma. Oh what my you... god, a hair across jumped me this. <laughs> <laughs> What are you both doing here? Yeah. Is, uh, no, it's me. Carmine? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Is Carmine okay? And did you see a girl come by here? Slow down, Kieran. One question at a time. <laughs> Carmine is at home, sleeping in her room. She must have tuckered herself out with all that dancing. <laughs> I'm not concerned for her mental stability at all. So she's safe, that's good. I thought we'd step out while she slept to get some of her favorite noodles from the stall here. This tic-tac really is degrading the mental health of our youth. <laughs> A taste of her favorite food might help help her help snap her out of whatever is going on with her A poison cure oh yeah i hope so good thinking grandpa now what was that you were saying about some girl coming this way oh right everyone in town is acting all weird and one of the girls who came from here from paldea went missing She's wearing a school uniform. Well, now that you mention it, we did run into a girl wearing a uniform not too long ago. You spoke with her, dear. What'd she say? Oh. Uh-oh, we can't see her eyes. <laughs> Dearest. Have some mochi. Hmm? I... I don't need any mochi at the moment. Oh, dear. Have some mochi. Eat it. Eat the, the, the mochi. Oh my god, is, this is just trolls too. Or <laughs> troll too. And they're gonna eat me, oh my god. <laughs> I actually... I, d I know nothing about troll too aside from that. Oh man, um... Incredibly stupid film. It is like... The director did not like vegetarians, and mm. part of the uh, thing is that the evil uh, town of secret goblins is trying to get the humans to eat, um, the human visitors to eat food that is full of uh, green stuff that turns them into 
uh, like plant matter, basically. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Grandma? It's just awfully sudden, dear, but I suppose if you insist. No, don't do it. Hmm. Munch, munch. Go right, I've had some mochi, dear. Now, can we get back to the question? Hmm? Dark metamorphosis! Midnight of my soul! The, the idea of a village being fully, like, poisoned by somebody <laughs> intentionally contaminating the food supply is genuinely horrendous? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Grandpa, oh, are you okay? Don't you get a set soon as to be kidding me. Oh, I didn't switch Indeedy out. Fuck. All right, fine. Oh, Hideko and Yukito. We've learned their names. <laughs> mochi, mochi. I say mochi, you say mochi. mochi. A, 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 a Japanese like word or phrase that I um have like tried to make the distinction of, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, kimochi is supposed to mean like uh, something feels good or it's like a, 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 you, you say in response to a pleasant feeling of some kind uh, yeah. but there is also I think if something's gross like disgusting uh, kimochi is also a thing that you say like it, it, I think it's a, a, um, either a homophone or a homonym where it's uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah it might be kimoi uh, for gross, but they're close enough where getting it wrong feels like a problem. <laughs> Man. Huh. Because, uh, you know, I like mochi. Mochi is pleasant, but uh, poisoned mochi is disgusting. So I guess both of those. <laughs> Uh, both of those words would be appropriate to describe mochi. I mean, you don't know that it's disgusting. Mm. That's true. We've not seen anybody go like, Ugh, what? Not mochi? Mm, let's see. Grandpa, Grandma, what's gone into you? Fucking school oh, tactics in the tent. Getting this chance to um, fight characters that we would have absolutely no, no interest in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. And the Pokemon that they own as well, I would not expect this lady to have a chandelier or a Mamoswine. Yeah, but they're fun picks. Mm. Um, I, I think. I think that makes. I think chandelier for a grandma makes a degree of sense. Mm -hmm. The grandpa Mamoswine. having wheezing an Arbok though is. Uh, True. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do with that. Eat mochi. Oh, I'm still catching up. Oh, I thought you were ahead of me. Um, Chandelier oh, no. decided to spend its first turn using protect, and I was like, okay, so you'll go. You're here to waste my time, then. I understand. Uh, no, this is a uh, rather tanky wheezing. Hmm. 
Let's see. To to uh, circumstances credit, even though Indeedy is not necessarily a heavy hitter by herself, uh, stab psychic terrain psychic does actual damage. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, there we go. I just really, I can change that to expanding force for basically free, can't I? Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> Mochi mochi. Mochi sadly. Mochi. Oh man, no way. Gramps and Grandma too? Everyone's losing it. It's just a matter of time <laughs> until it gets me. I'm gonna end up like all the rest of them. Calm down, slap. <laughs> looks down at his arm has been bitten by a mochi <laughs> <laughs> i haven't been bitten <laughs> sorry i'm kind of panicked there thanks for after okay let's think before gramps started acting like carmine he ate one of those weird mochi oh my god you're right kieran mm -hmm. Rafter, how are you two doing up there? You okay? How are you two? We're fine over here, though Penny got herself all spooked and has been kind of a mess. We got worried because we hadn't heard from you in a while, so we decided to step outside. Things are weird out here, little buddy. We were all attacked by these folks shouting mochi mochi at us, and we couldn't spot you anywhere, so I was starting to fear the worst. We're holding tight by that Peachy's place for the moment, but... Ah! They're getting closer! <laughs> There's something there! There's something there! Oh, no, that's Penny. The face portrait didn't change. Um... Ah! Ugh, there's something there! No, that's not her voice anyway. It doesn't matter. I've already done the yelling. There's something there, Alvin. <laughs> Penny, what... Whoa! What's wrong? Are you two okay? Oh, crud, this does not look good. <laughs> Just died. Ar <laughs> Arvin! 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 Snake! Eggins! <laughs> Solid silicobra. Um, something, <laughs> something must have got them. Was there a dedicated snake in Unova? Mm, I don't think in Unova. No. Uh, the only snake mons I can think of are Ekans, Arbok, and Saviper. Mm. And then Silicobra and Sandaconda from Gen 8. But yeah, oh, I guess right. that's it. Yeah. Grandpa, Grandma, I'll be back, so don't go anywhere. I okay. still... I still want to find the Mona, but we got to get to Peachy's and check on Arvin and Penny. Let's go. Oh, I wonder if our mons get healed up after that, because my group. Okay, they do. Mhm. Mm you, you took a you took a bit of a slappy. A little, little bit. Um, Chroma Dancer did not enjoy getting repeatedly gunk shotted. Mhm. Mm Actually, to be honest, having a Iron Crown up front is not ideal either because then i still have to wait like six seconds of like booster energy was used up and i'm like i know <laughs> I, you don't you don't need to tell me oh i'm getting um visual display lag as well actually hold on oh yellow king has done the research for me so kimochi directly means feeling but is implied to mean good feeling Kimochi Wari is means bad feeling and is implied by grossness, meaning that when people are being, I guess, colloquial then, they'll not say the Wari part and just be like Kimochi with negative downturn to suggest gross. Okay, okay. Mm, interesting. Uh, give me a second. Elgato is going to vanish for a couple seconds. Goodbye. No, two, two. Okay. Wait, hold on. I didn't actually check where I'm supposed to be going. Okay, it's over there. It's over there. Yeah, it's just going back to town. 
I I assume flying like this is re reasonably fast. I think so. I I genuinely don't know. If you do seem to go. You running. do seem to go faster if you are diving, but uh. Yeah. Did you do the the flight challenges? I did. Um. I did not do the, the super hard ones yet. No. I've, I've done easy and normal, and then I did hard, and then it took a a turn where I just didn't see where the rings went, and so I timed out because I didn't know where oh. to go next. Um. But I should have a go at that again at some point. Arvin, Penny! <laughs> there you guys are! Oh no, there you guys are! What happened? Ah, oh, yes. So, sorry about hanging up on you like that. It probably gave you the wrong impression. It was all Penny's fault. She went into full panic mode and ran smack into me with her head. So I dropped my phone. Can you blame me? Look at the people in this town. Something's seriously wrong with them. Uh, never mind whatever that thing was. Weird thing. What are you talking about? It was like round and little and weird. And just where is this little hallucination round, of yours? Little are you sure you weren't seeing stuff? I think that's just like half of the people I know online. <laughs> it was real. I really saw it. Uh, just, uh, I, I guess I we collectively know. <laughs> it is Billy Bull. <laughs> A bunch of little guys. <laughs> you sure you did? I think I might have figured out why everyone is acting so strange. Until we know for sure, though, we should. Interrupted. Whoa! Heads up, guys. There's something up there. So, I didn't catch any- Look! Up there! An alien. That's the thing I saw earlier. Is it a drone? No. I think it's a Pokemon? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this is box him in the head. That's actually pretty good. Huh? Is this mochi? It's kind of sweet. I like it. No, wait, don't eat those. Whoa, what? Ah, you do okay? Mo, 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 mochi. 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 Mochi, in it. <laughs> it's an evil belly bolt. Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> Holy shit, it's that guy from Meteos. Oh, but he's kind of more doing the walking man. He's more like doing the running man than the funky chicken, actually. <laughs> Mo mochi. Penny. <laughs> Penny's pronouncing it wrong. That's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> mochi, mochi. <laughs> hey, Sheila, how's it going? We are doing the chicken dance. Well, does Penny seem a... Uh, even more worked up than anyone else. But more importantly, I'm so sorry. If only we'd managed to warn them in time. This weird mochi came from that thing. So, so, um, Sheila, this is uh, Pokemon decides to do a zombie movie. No fair! That jerk's using them as a shield. We've got to find out some way to calm the two of them down. I know. We'll eat some mochi. Mhm. Mm Make them think we're one of them. Okay, it's fine. I'll just run around to the other side. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Right. Well. How you been, Sheila? How's your day been? Oh my god, I just realized the mochi mochi theme kind of reminds me of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Mmm. Mochi. 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 I wonder how I wonder how their teams have grown since. Still leading on the Umbreon. I mean Umbreon is pretty tanky. 
まあまあゲッツンブネルモチエスライトヤロウエスカウントラクトダークパープルモチエアレッシーヘアアンディーヘブタイプアドバンテージクロスレスアイコンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディスコネアンディス
Ah, yeah, they've, they've got a big work commute now. I'm, I'm guessing that was psychic damage and not physics damage, because if you were getting uh, physically roughed up, I'd be uh, very concerned. Okay, I made it through to the other side. Turns out having a quick wobble at big numbers uh, actually not not that bad. Mm -hmm. Missed. Fuck. No, I'm uh, I'm a little behind here, but uh, uh, no worries. The train is fine, but the orientation for your new job has broken your brain. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, that's funny. Using like flare blitz to put yourself in citrus berry range. Oh, sure, to see if you can get an extra Flare Blitz out. Mm. Oh, the special attack drop in Moonblast is not what I want to see. Oh, rude. Mm. We may have to pivot here, fuck. Okay. I mean, if you get Psychedelia out uh, and then are able to give it to um, Iron Crown. Hmm. It's more that both of them, I, I'm, I'm concerned about oh, the... Oh, oh, dark type. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, just one more left. So now we're putting in work, actually. Unsurprisingly, a good mon. And he's saying they literally sat in the same room today for the entire eight and a half hour workday and did nothing. Mm. Um, looked at by the end for pure, pure BS. I well, hate, I hate workshops and panels and meetings where you're just supposed to sit there and do nothing for the entire runtime. Genuinely makes my brain <laughs> fall, fall to pieces. I will, my, I, I will genuinely fall asleep if I'm to sit in one place and do nothing for an extended period of time and not engage. So I used to actually get in trouble for dozing off in meetings as a result. Um, <laughs> how does someone have the lungs, time, and will for a non-stop lecture for over eight hours? There wasn't even those. I spent the day waiting for a laptop that never got. Man. Horrifying. Michi. <laughs> Mochi. Oh, yeah, it's like, oh, I'm not active. Must be time to hibernate. Uh, un unsurprising to no one, least of all myself, that I am uh, diagnosed with ADHD. <laughs> now, the <laughs> idea of like, hey, you know what would be great for your brain is to uh, sit in a space where you are not supposed to uh, contribute anything and you are punished if you fidget and do something else. Oh. <laughs> More. Hey. Oh, and Penny, I'm, I'm really sorry, guys. Where do you think you're going? You're next. <laughs> Just sliding along. Uh, Pe. Cha cha cha. Cha cha, real smooth. <laughs> Get its ass! I'm immediately getting to the Pokemon Center. My team got roughed up. Oh no, they're it, they're out of yield. Oh okay. Ah oh, yeah yeah yeah. Okay. Where did it, how far did it go anyway? Oh wow, it went all the way to the loyalty plaza. Hmm. Whoosh. A oh, whoosh. They did switch out in DD. It's currently, um, it's currently, oh. <laughs> that's very it's funny. Slowly <laughs> floating death. And then just gets up. Um, it is, it is currently, uh, Clawpunk the Excadrill who's in front. Um, it's gotta be around here somewhere. Okay. <laughs> 
They're here for they gave uh, chase. Moral support. It'll get better though. The horrendousness of the orientation is circumstantial, and everybody has been nice, but this has been a terrible first impression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, is that Nimona? Oh, thank goodness, you're okay. Did she run around the entire island? This is in the opposite direction from where she moved before. <laughs> Mochi, mochi. I should have figured. Mochi. 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 Match! <laughs> Did she just say match? Guess even the mochi couldn't override her battle mania completely. Pokey mochi. <laughs> oh man, it's got control of the Mona. There's no way I can hold her off. She's still horny for battle even while hypnotized. Yeah. The wow. Yandere runs strong. Oh my god. <laughs> Everyone is here. Mochi mochi. Mochi mochi. This is bad. Everyone mochi. from Masui is coming here. Watch my Watch back, my for, back me. for me. I'm not gonna tell you. Come on, you take use the spread attack. Alright, good luck. Surf asses. We'll keep on. I'll focus on keeping the village from getting any villages from getting any closer. A rafter, do your best with the mono and whatever that thing is. Maybe everyone will go back to normal if you beat it. Just spam surf. This is like a Gen 6 horde exactly. battle, right? Yeah, yeah. Quapunk. Uh, drop them all in a hole. <laughs> Let's use Earthquake. <laughs> oh, cheap match. No, cheap match. Not even champion the Mona. Oh, it's singles? All right. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I'm not even mind controlled for this. I just kind of want to, I want to do this anyway, honestly. Mochi. Let's have Mochi full match. It is very funny to me, the idea that um, her Yandere goes too strong. Yeah, no, it does. <laughs> oh, good luck. Good luck. Mochi. Ouchie. That is just, that is so funny that her Yandere tendencies are like, no no, the, the thrill of battle is too strong. <laughs> you cannot pull me away from fighting my bestie. Oh poor Mutt out poor, poor Mutt out levels me actually. That's funny. I am sad I'm showing up with a freaking or choreo to the singles match, but <laughs> that's okay. It's Okay. It's not like you were able to get it out with the in the, the tag team before either, to be honest. Uh Komo is part steep no, it's fighting dragon, right? Fighting dragon, yeah. I keep wanting to say it's steel because it's covered in the scales, but uh I click hurricane. Oh, it's okay. Polly used double shock, which didn't kill, and now it loses its electric type, so now it's just fighting, and if this hurricane actually hits. Mm. Oh, gee. <laughs> Air slash. A hurricane hits, and it is obliterated, thank goodness. Oh, oh with the para as well? Read. Ultra. <laughs> oh right, I just realized I switched out beforehand. Oops. I oh I guess I kind of said like, you know, oh if I do that, you know, if the game is gonna not allow me to turn that off, that must be an intentional option. But, Tough um, me out so I wouldn't feel sad, but I'm paralyzed anyway, so it doesn't <laughs> fucking matter. God, okay. Um Hey, if I switch into Claw Punk, I will immediately like be immune to that Thunder Punch, so. Oh, Gujar's pack an ice beam. Goodbye, mm. Josh, out your choreo. Mm -hmm. 
iron head. Okay, you're right. You are confused. Surely you're not going to sludge your pack and sludge bomb. No. Oh. Okay, we live, bitch. <laughs> oh, we got poisoned. Oh, awful. Yeah, no, I didn't bring either my fairy or my um, ice types with me, so I guess I'll just fight Gudra legit. Mm, I'm running with my dancer team, so. Uh... It just so happened that I didn't put Porygon Z in this lineup, otherwise it would have been. Of course. Like... Oh, no, I've got this. This is really more. You're throwing out Kamo against Hatterene. Interesting. Hmm. You must know something that I don't. Like you saw an Iron Head. Yeah. I was really quick, and now mm. Dazzling Gleam is sending you straight to, straight to hell. hell. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Ribombi! Wow. Really? That's her pick? Cute. They have a present for you, Iron Head. <laughs> <laughs> Crit Iron Head, goodbye. She also has Dust Noir. Hmm. I have. I'm so sad that Dust Noir isn't good. The design is so cool. Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, Quaquaval. That makes sense. Um. Oh, of course, yeah. Fuck it, Misty Explode. Yeah, you got Shadow Sneak. There's no way of getting that off. <laughs> um. May I give you a very slight spoiler? Sure. Uh, so, there is a... There is a meme in the, uh, competitive Pokemon, uh, at least Reddit community, mm -hmm. about Ice Punch Dusk Noir, mm -hmm. as there was a kind of infamous post, of, you know, from the whole, like, uh, all these, you know, freaking tryhards running with their, um, you know, they're not even using Pokemon they care about. Mm. Well, guess what? what uh, if I use Ice Punch to one hit Shirlando team, now what? And it's like, dog. We did the calculations, that that's not po possible. That, that only works on a crit. <laughs> or if you like Swords Dance first, also Lando T outspeeds you. Mm. And so the idea of Ice Punch Dust Noir is just common, common meme, and for Dust Noir, it totally has Ice Punch. Mm -hmm. huh. Good going using Aqua Step. <laughs> Although, you being a fighting type now means that Thunderbolt is no longer super effective, which is mildly annoying. Um... I mean, you can just click Hydro Punch. Yeah. Uh, and so I did. <laughs> Goodbye. Kapow! And it hit, even. Hey, I was fully expecting it to not. <laughs> Alright, you're out of here. Okay, I've, I've got her down to a race. She's out with the uh, Skeledurge, who just Terra Ghost. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. Here I go, Chi. A Torch Song. <gasps> oh my god, because I switched into. I, I hard switched into um, Castanet the Kamo, and mm -hmm. I have sound. I mm -hmm. soundproof. So <laughs> I can't do it. That's very funny to me. Love that. Yeah, I'm just going to keep clicking Iron Head and uh, flinch you to death. Mm -hmm. It's not going to do a lot of damage. Uh, oh boy, you've got Shadow Ball. This may hurt more. Oh, yeah, you're going to win this damage race unless I Terra. I got like three more Pokemon in the back, so I'm not remotely worried. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just... It's a damage race between these two Mon, and you have another two Mon in the back. Exactly, yeah. I do love with the terror animation, you can see the the whole crowd doing the mm -hmm. doing the dance behind mm -hmm. us. Again, not the type of game that Pokemon is, but it would be very funny if this match had a turn limit as the <laughs> other mochi possessed are like advancing towards you every turn. Wow. Oh, that would be fun. You know, good point, uh, Yellow King Hunter. <laughs> oh. 
not done yet. Match, matchy, mochi. Okay, if I got the flinch there, oh, okay. It had earth power this entire time and chose to keep hitting me with shit. Wild. Um, I mean, puzzle yeah. fights in Pokemon are a really interesting idea. I, I was one of the few people that really liked um, the cinema in Black and White 2, where it basically gives you a specific series of puzzle battles with uh, enemies and machines and stuff that have intentionally odd typings, so you don't necessarily know what the best plan of attack is. Those were all very cool. There we go. Aqua Jet just closed it out. Mm -hmm. The Mochi epilogue watching. just turns into Pokestar Studios. <laughs> yes, I'm just like, cut, cut, cut. I don't believe it. <laughs> <sighs> mochi. Skills, Mochi. Ma... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you piece of shit. What did you do to my friends and family? <laughs> oh, we did not get healed up after that one. No. Um, I'm gonna. Is this is this is this thing part ghost? I don't know. I it's certainly part poison. Hmm. It might be poison fairy. Okay. Maybe. Because uh, I'm like, if we need to go catch it, I may go and uh, put my uh, catching galade in front. Ah, uh, of course just I make my life easier should actually think about what my team is going to be for catching this because i'd like to i have master balls but i'd like to save them if possible pokestar wow. studios did have a zombie series with the red mist aliens yeah um there was a a, a run of uh i think white 2 on game stone quick relatively recently and they were like oh man fucking hate being dragged to Pokestar Studios. It's not completing the game and it's all side quests that doesn't do anything. Which, sure, I get it. But um, they raise that there is a number of different endings that uh, you can reach uh, by doing what you're asked, doing what you asked really well, failing it. And sometimes you get weird conditions. So the first match that you do in the tutorial, you're given a Rioli with Ice Punch. And if the ice punch freezes, then the show stops there and you get the strange ending of that version of the script. <laughs> oh, cool. So it actually accounts for like weird outcomes with the forced movesets it gives you, which I think is very cool. That's fun. Oh, let's see. Do yeah, I want to challenge realizing. the strange Pokemon? Yes. I'm realizing I gotta pick something that's not mm. gonna insta give it. Uh, I think Chroma yeah, Dancer yeah, yeah. off of Jetting would probably be okay. Good Imagine if we said no and just flew. Oh, back it's a that. um, it's a raid style button. Okay. Oh, okay. That feels. Oh, and it's gonna give us a choice to use whatever at the end. Okay, mm -hmm. I feel a lot better about this. I actually like this a lot better for, um... Oh, it's not even the difficult one. It does not like being hit with Psycho Cut. <laughs> you damaged it. That means you can beat it. Keep it up. You got this. Because, uh, Ogre Pond. Oh, yeah, that's right. Its gimmick is if you get poisoned, you are then also confused. That's funny. Yes, that that is uh, its ability. Um, toxic. Uh, oh, jeez. Uh, it's like poison puppeteer. That's it. Mm. Fire up and finish it, Rafter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, I <laughs> I gotta catch up to you. Maybe maybe don't hit yourself. That'd be that'd be a good idea. Shit. Oh, it has nasty plot. Okay. Huh. I could probably yeah, go switch to Castanet mm -hmm. and 
Terra Steel, and then what the hell is it gonna do? Mm. Yeah, this was a lot more than uh, it was. Because <laughs> my um my my catching Gallade is level 100. I was uh, expecting this to be just a I have to catch this, and it would be very annoying rather than an actual like fight. So I clearly went in way harder than I intended to for the circumstances. Um, <laughs> All right, now you get to think about what ball you want to put it in. Mm, the Safari Ball might be a good set. I, I was kind of like looking at maybe the Love Ball. Mm. Um, get that color coordination there. And yes, I'm still now casting that does not care about Toxic. Mm -hmm. And yeah, Kieran had the character arc. Mm -hmm. No wow, better Iron than to... Uh... Yeah, you get Safari Ball. Uh, it may only be able to click Nasty Plot at me, which is quite funny. <laughs> oh, are you coming in with a Steel type so there's nothing it can do about it? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Disrespect with the Pokeball. Nah. I think the Jungle Camo pattern on it reads as poison to me. I think it makes sense. Does it? Okay. Yeah. It, it, oh, it, it's it, also got Shadow Ball. Oh, that's... I lived. It sits in my head as the same kind of like um, that kind of color patterning makes me think of like poisonous swamps in video games. Mm, okay, I it just makes me think of like military camo. Mm, it is poison ghost, huh? Yeah, uh, which is good to know. So I'm glad I didn't try to click grain, grain punch, drain punch even. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Um, you know what, my. Blaziken has not been able to do anything so far since so I've been keeping it in the back. Let's let's put this to rest with the Blaze Kick. Oh, just a sliver of health left. Ah, one HP in a dream. Oh my god. Malignant Chain took me down to two HP. Oh, is that its like signature move? Yeah. Uh <laughs> great, but nice come and go. That that's good. Okay, there we go. Um, Acrobaticus animation is so silly. Like, <laughs> I love the fact that it, like, really quickly teleports your um, mon around it, but the fact that it's just in its generic standing animation, so silly looking. <laughs> uh, let's see. Ooh. I could go with Dream Ball. I think I'm going to go with Dream Ball. Sure. I used my Dream Ball on uh, something else, I think. Uh no, oh, I think that's what my Terrapagos is currently inside. Ah, uh, I see. I, I have I have not investigated the slot machine to go and get a bunch of extra balls. <laughs> D did you get it? And then everyone else should be. Ugh, actually doing his voice is starting to make my throat hurt a little bit. I'm going to ease off oh. on that. My mouth is still recovering. You want me to take him for a bit? It's fine, I just won't put the, the grain on it. Hmm? What are we all doing here? How did I end up at the Lucy Plaza? Now everybody's back to normal. What kind of poison do you think he used on all of these people? Um... Do hmm. we need to, like, get a Nurse Joy army what, out here what or something? Is, get a different triage? There is, it's sodium pentothal that is, like, what, what people knew as truth serum uh, <laughs> uh, back in the day. The idea of, like, a chemical compound that makes people's inhibitions kind of drop so they're easy, more easily suggested to do things. Mm -hmm. that, that feels most plausible. Um, Costa, Rafter, Kieran... The last thing I remember was getting to the shop. What happened? So, first, and after that, but then they all... To shreds, you say? <laughs> Seriously? So all that mochi mochi stuff was because of some Pokemon? See? See? I told you it was real. Unlike dumb horror movie tropes like Curses. That round little monster was behind everything, like just like I said. Uh, when did you say that? Anyway, Rafter went and caught the thing, as he does. <laughs> he sure did. 
There are cursed Pokemon. This is true. Your mask exists. <laughs> Drifloon exists. <laughs> Wait, what about Nimona? Watch this be like, oh, I wasn't really possessed at all. I just wanted a fun excuse to battle you. I mean, hell, I said that earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, please don't say mochi mochi. Mochi match. Uh, the curse wasn't lifted. Huh? What's going on? Did we find the remote? That's what you want to know? Sheesh. Glad you're back to normal now, at least. Yep. Morning, everybody. You know, I had this crazy realistic dream that I was battling Rafter. And you lost. It was awesome. Sign me up to have that dream again. <laughs> Wait, what happened to my Pokemon? Why have they all fainted? <laughs> Wow, and I'm right in the place where the dream took place. Mm -hmm. Haha. No, Mona really is... something? Yeah, sure is. Iggy and Rafter? Sis, Cramps, Grandpa. What the heck's going on? Why is everyone up here? Someone better start explaining. Actually... Huh. What a weird feeling. Somehow it feels like I'm seeing you for the first time in ages. They hate each other marginally less. And that's the importance of being hashtag seen. <laughs> Several days later. Oh my god, Aster caught a Petra run. Congrats. <laughs> uh, hold on. Can we go to the box and nickname it together? Sure, sure, sure. Mm hmm. Uh, just summary. <laughs> There's a cork pop noise as part of the uh, <laughs> sound effect. That's great. I guess it does kind of look like it has two corks in it. Mm hmm. Ooh, let's see. Thinking, thinking. Hmm. Mm. Okay, I've got one. It's six letters long. Okay. Uh. Oh, right. Okay. Uh. Okay. Hmm. I'm trying to think of something that is appropriately thematic for the thing and it's surprisingly hard. Um <laughs> You know what? You know what? Yeah, we're gonna go with this, and if it's the same thing as you, then that's funny. Uh oh no, it's not going to be. It's not going to be. So okay, this would this would work then. Alright, count me down. Okay. Three, two, one, smoochy. Mochi Spears. Okay, we got it. There it is. I think it's got to be two separate words. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because oh. you know that it's toxic, etc. Yeah. And I love what you do. Let <laughs> me let me be the first to say I love what you do. All right, all right. Mochi Spears. Okay. <laughs> Gang's all here. Gang's all here. Everyone got their stuff together? Yes. Oh, oh do we have to go outside? Is that the thing? Yeah, uh, we, we've got to go home. Mm -hmm. I was expecting to, like, talk to them, and then I'd be like, you ready to leave? But we have to go outside, that's fine. This expression being totally indifferent is so relatable. <laughs> so, fine. Yes, you have named me that. Good for you. All right, I'm in the ball. Hey, you guys. Oh, you're still loading. Mm. 
seems like loading times while do docked are higher. Maybe. Uh, I might also have an older generation switch, and uh, it might also possible. be because I'm connected to you rather than the other way around. Fact is. You really going home already? I wouldn't mind if you stayed longer. We'll come back again. Yeah, you'd better. Hey, uh, Rafter, everyone, thank you all so much for coming. No, oh, we should be the ones thanking you for showing us such a good time. And the food, man. Everything we ate here was so good. The festival was a lot of fun, too. I even got to buy a VV mask. What more could you want? <laughs> well, good. I'm glad you like it here. Time really flew by. Just goes to show how much fun we were having, huh? Wish I could have fit in more battles against both of you, though. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You battled each of us a dozen times or more. Welcome to the Nimona Survivors Club. I really am happy to got to meet you all. I've been thinking about it a lot. And I'm gonna give Blueberry Academy another shot. Thanks. I'm really gonna go for it this time. I'm really gonna go for it this time. What do you got this kid? Please graduate. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Rafter. Uh, I guess that means my vacation's over, too. She evaporates into light. <laughs> hey, you understand that joke? You've, watched, you've seen Kingdom Hearts 2 now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Farewell, she says, as she just uh, fades. Mm -hmm. Time for me to head back to school, too, then. Hey, sis, thanks for, like, coming with me here and everything. This has been great, seriously. I'm real glad I got to come here and meet you all. And, Kieran, I'm really sorry for trying to flex on you the way I did when I first got here. Huh? Were you? I didn't even notice. You're that bad at it. Don't worry about it, Arvin. Feel free to flex on Kiki as much as you like. It's pretty fun. I do it all the time. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, wow. looks like Carmine's another one with a big personality, huh? Yeah, sorry about her. I, I'm right here. Excuse me? Who do you think you're apologizing for? And you guys, what do you mean by big personality? <laughs> Never mind, guess it was more like 10 minutes for him, William. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Mochi Mayhem. The end. Oh man, is it Ed Sheeran time again? No, no, no. It can't no. possibly be. The gap between those credits was nothing. <laughs> okay, it does not appear to be Ed time. The number of people you can invite to the club room has increased. Okay. Well, I think that might bring us to the uh, thrilling conclusion. Yeah, I, th I think I think that is that was Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. <laughs> that was Pokemon Scarlet and Violet right there. Um, would you? How about we take a five-minute break and then? Yeah. How do you feel about doing a um, doing three show matches? Yeah, no, I can do a best of three. Uh, let me go and set the timer so it actually says five rather than ten. Uh, let me go. Uh, I don't want it to be over. <laughs> oh, well, I'm glad that you enjoyed uh, hanging out with us uh, for yeah. the generation. This the the dice duo the the dice duo is not over. Uh, there there will continue to be there will continue to be more of this nonsense as time proceeds. You can't uh, get rid of us that easily. But we'll be uh, we'll be switching to different games for a while. Um, we've currently been talking about uh, the. Mega Man Legacy Collection Edition of Battle Network 6 as a parity to our Battle Network 3 uh, that we that we did in the past. Um, I have a think about what other games in this vibe uh, we could do. I still have a, a more of a penchant for co-op games than versus ones, but we'll, we'll, have, we'll, have, a th we'll have a think about what things could be done. Um, there are a handful of, like, 
divinity ups that I would like to play, but I have a feeling that's the thing that we'd want to loop like Max and uh, Joe into rather than doing air. But uh, probably. But yeah, yeah. Let's go uh, to a five minute break while I go and sort out my team or whatever, and then we uh, when we get back, battling. All right. See you in life. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back! Now the story has been completed. It is time for exhibition matches, I suppose. Um, yeah, the final showdown. There we go. Now, Sorry, is this, is this uh, VGC rules where we're picking four, or is this a full set of six? I was thinking of sticking with the uh, in Indigo Disc rules where we are um, getting a full, full set of six. Right, okay. Yeah, this is... Um, I, I was in a real interesting situation for this. Um, mm -hmm. Give me a second before I... Uh, let's see. Yeah, what? Um... Will you do me a favor and put... I, I think we should agree on what the music is so we can be listening to the same thing. Okay. I, I kind of feel like it's got to be AI Professor, but I... Sure, we can do that. I, I mean, I, I, cool. love, I love the AI Professor Bell theme, so yeah. It's a great theme. Okay. So yeah, this is a team that I... Uh, mm. it, it's, I was in a real bind knowing like, okay, Castor is probably not going to be changing their team very much so i have i have some forward knowledge yeah his suing lilligant um, is an interesting choice i don't actually know what she does but uh i i did not want to just be like haha i have the perfect counter to you he he hoo, hoo, hoo. i'm a big <laughs> jerk um who you hate you can do what so, thou wilt <laughs> but sure yeah yeah, yeah. so you you uh, uh, switch things up a bit huh so this is a team uh, in tribute to our uh, Soul Link Nuzlocks that we have played so far. I can see the Verhoots is in there. Did we catch a Zorua? <laughs> uh, we did not, but that is N Zoroark. Ah, right. Okay, okay. Transferred all the way up. Hmm. Okay, and the loser deletes their channel, right? <laughs> uh, one of us stands more to lose if you do that. But, uh... <laughs> what <are> you <laughs> I don't know what Hisuian right. Bravery Check does. It it's Gold Soul and Junior Jam. I put Junior Jam in Legends to... Uh... Oh, so you could evolve it that way, I see. Yeah. I didn't catch her, uh, because that's exclusive to your version, so I wouldn't have caught her, Rufflet. Uh, Rufflet died, right? <laughs> Rufflet did not survive. Um, yes, that is true. So, all I know that about Hisuian Bravery is that it's psychic flying and literally nothing else. Let's see. Sensible. Another familiar face. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, big hit. Yeah, no, without the strength without of my soul caster. Without the uh the the presence of Dynamaxing to increase HP pools, uh <laughs> Excadrill is considerably more risky. Um hmm. You tried to cover my soul up with rocks, but I should shine <laughs> with golden sheen. Hmm. Uh, yeah, this one.
can be super effective, won't it? Mm -hmm. And got the herb, which lets you instantly use it. Okay. Oh, that's that one. All right. Junior Jai of the distant past. <laughs> the distant past. Do you remember, Caster, when we were friends, allies, soul bound? <laughs> now we face down uh, on the final battlefield. Sure I'm surprised that Ice Shard is. Oh, is Ice Shard a priority? It is, yes. Ah! Signature move, I guess. And does it have any special properties? Uh, it has a. I don't remember what it has a chance to do, but it's basically psychic. Mm. But this is uh, kind of expected as to what uh, would happen if both of my team were taken down in one, in one turn. Um, let's see. Esper Wing uh, has a higher. Ratio and a and raises ah uh, yes and raises the user speed. Mm. We should still be under the presence of Tailwind here. Ooh, let's see, yeah. Wait, hold on. Why doesn't it affect you? I'm, I'm, j oh, right, okay, I understand. <laughs> <laughs> you thought it was, you thought it was me, but mm. in fact. If we get both, that's very funny. <laughs> Something wrong, you look like you're seeing devil. Mm. Uh... Oh sure, yeah. You don't want to be, you don't want to remain a fighting type. <laughs> I'm pranking my hog caster. What? Ah, oh, you're faster. Dang. Okay, well. Yeah, tell him Peter about. Uh, this is probably GG for me then. <laughs> Both of them at the same time. That's fine. Oh, right. You're in gone. God. In fact, it was Harmonia, <laughs> because I remembered N's name, damn it. <laughs> uh, okay. Illusion only breaks if you take damage. Mm. Oh, fishing for the freeze. Oh my god, <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Well, I, I guess you wish you were a fucking fire type now, huh? 
that is so funny. I... Incredible. I mean, I can't win now. <laughs> this is this is you this is just praying. I I'm I'm just praying at this point that uh, <laughs> uh, I continue to be lucky. But uh, this is now a two v one, so I, I don't think I'm. Gonna win. Yeah. What is N's full name? Hmm? Natural, natural Harmonia Gropius. I remember okay. that. That's fine. Oh yeah, no, it's a flare blitz melted the ice. What? I didn't realize it worked that way. Well, GG, I fucking guess. All right. <laughs> yeah, if you use a fire move, it uh, melts the ice. Oh. Ooh. Then the freeze did not matter <laughs> at any I point. Did. I, it, it did, because last turn I clicked a non-fire move. Right, um, okay. <laughs> oh, GG, good match. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Would you like to? Would you like to go again? Yeah, sure. We said this was a best of three, so I can just do this again. I can run this team again. Yeah, I don't think I need to make any modifications. No, clearly not. <laughs> uh, right. Okay. Mm. Opener options are a little difficult here. Now, but... Yeah, let's see. Some builds that I have used to reasonable success in Sword and Shield just don't work anymore in this new environment. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, uh, stuff. I, it's easier to get away with Life Orb Porygon Z when you are huge and you have the health the health pool <laughs> to justify it. I see. Sure, with, with Dynamax. Mm -hmm. uh, likewise, being able to kind of increase the physical and special defense of. Uh, Excadrill, so he can stick around and make use of weakness policy, but under current circumstances, it's too squishy, really, to sensibly do that. Um... Switch at the start, or just psychedelia? Unclear. Yeah, I don't want you to use the icicle move again. <laughs> <laughs> I. That makes sense. Oh, no, okay, not a double switch. Oh, just a fully different. I never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fuck my life, I, I guess. I figured I'm not gonna be able to stop you from getting carried in that. But I can get my own up. Well, okay. We're already in a poor position. Um... Jim, you've grown so big, and your head is your hair is whack. Mm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Decisions. Decisions. Oh, man, I should have doubled. <laughs> oh, lucky. 
Oh my god. Oh, oh my it crit. God. Right. Because I would be like, hit. spread heat wave, I should be able to survive. But, uh. Right? That's right, that's uh, I guess we both got our ghost of luck after him. Hmm. Uh, it's more in your favor than in mine, though. And so is mine, so yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how it works. Okay, well, let's see. How the herb returns, mm. and how the herb returns. We didn't get the, uh... The, the back row last time. Um, Mr. Tachyon is very strong and true. Oh, I keep forgetting to nickname Iron Crown. It's fine, whatever. Um, oh, that's probably the play, yeah. That's definitely the play. Okay. Mm, it's gross fighting, right? Probably faster than the T, right? Mm, all right. I can't tell which one that is. <laughs> That's probably the real one. You would think. Oh, it would clear the terrain. Sure, sure. <laughs> Makes sense. Well, I'm glad I failed. Mm. Yeah, that's not just that. All right. Well, you guessed right on uh, which was real. Mm. changed. True. Oh god, that's really for acrobatics. Okay. 
<laughs> extremely necessary. <laughs> yeah. You also fell asleep. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> and flinch and got KO'd. <laughs> and whatever the opposite of toughing it out is. No, that's not enough. Damn it. Okay. Oh, hmm. Yeah, no, we're in a bad fucking spot. I'm not in unburdened range yet. If I was in unburdened, that would have definitely killed you. Man, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I was about to say, fuck, come on. That would, that would have been some truly heinously bad luck. Okay, GG. That's uh, two yeah, to you. Uh, I don't think I picked a low accuracy move. Okay. We can do a we can do a third one for all three sake if you want the white wash. Sure. Yeah. Let's uh, let's let's go for a third. That was a super close match. Good lord. <laughs> Is this your oh, last shit. two? I. Wait a second. Is this your last two? Like mon. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah yeah. yeah. This <laughs> is fucking. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Okay. Fair. That makes sense. It's fine. Use your plus one priority spread attack. To be fair, if I had lived and got off dazzling gleam, I might have won. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> but well, that, I would have been toast. Uh, that been but yeah, that wasn't. That wasn't. That wasn't to be. Uh, oh well. Oh, close one. Very close. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, uh, X, X, X is not very good against this team right now. <laughs> Alright, once more. Okay, good luck, have fun. Hmm. It's time to do Well timed, well timed. <laughs> yeah, very nice. Alright. starting like this. A 
No decisions, decisions. Mm. I don't want my mm -hmm. uh, soul to get Oh, you lived. Oh god, that did nothing. Oh, that is, <laughs> Fuck. That is That's embarrassing. <laughs> oh, mm. this was a stupid thing to lock in. Okay. I should remember what moves your Pokemon have. <laughs> oh, I just realized I made a mistake. Oh, well. Do you have a spread move on either of them? Doesn't matter because they're both gonna die. Okay. Uh, as far as I'm aware, it is mostly just, uh, has some typically only used for some niche things with, um, oh, words are escaping me right now, that's unfortunate. Uh, like, chlorophyll stuff. Mm -hmm. But you can tell I'm not exactly running a sun team, so, uh... Hey, the uh, availability of Ice Spinner is clearly something to be expected, honestly. Which, all things considered, uh, I may uh, be switching in the wrong Pokemon to be hit with Ice Spinner and immediately die. We'll see. That's funny. Oh no. You oh no. <laughs> oh, that's not even a sash. Dog. Oh, call me a dog because I'm upset about that. <laughs> well, uh. At the very least, I'm bopping to the- I, I switched to the patch run battle thing uh, for this last one. It's fucking bop. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's quite good. Yeah, reasonable. <laughs> It has other moves than Ice Spinner. Oh, ow. Jesus. Yeah, um, Embor's hidden ability is Reckless, which means its recoil moves do 20% more damage. Oh. <laughs> well, fuck. I'm still taking full fucking recoil from all this, but... At the very least, my, um, previous switch-ins... Uh, are we just getting turn one, two? Yeah, we were. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that was fully intentional to be able to do it more than once per match. Okay. How long is your tailwind? Oh, you've got a lot of tailwind time left. Oh, no. Okay.
go away. Yeah. That's bad. No, I figured the the idea of specifically making sure we could have multiple instances of uh, expanding this across the match instead of using it too early or too late would make sense. But uh, of course. It becomes um, not necessarily a deterrent, but a kind of like, oh, I can't just immediately KO both opposing Pokemon. That's a dangerous thing to do. Um, Man, this is funny to me. Okay. Oh, but it does. It, it functionally does not matter. <laughs> it's perfectly fine because I know it will KO one of them, even if the others are mute. Oh, they lived. I lived. Oh, they're right because you're booster energy. You don't have that bonus. Ah. Oh my God. Okay. Wow. Mm, that is. That is the. Uh, the disadvantage to uh, doing it the second time. I see, I see. Uh, okay. This is bad for me, though. I'm fully aware that... Uh... It's not already bad for me. Preparing for rock slide mess, <laughs> and I, sh I should out speed into Tachyon Cutter here. And two hits. Mm -hmm. Damn, GG. Hey, I managed to pull one of them back, GG. Yeah, no, the the second round of expanding forces is, is tasty to have, but you're right that it the. There is a damage drop from no longer having the booster energy. Um, I guess there isn't really a sensible way to, to pull on that, though. Mm -hmm. If I could make a recommendation, um, it may be... I could be wrong, but it may be worth... Um, if, if you're looking to use this team again for something like another... Uh, um, fluffy Barrage mm -hmm. event or something like that, then having a... Uh, Speed booster instead of special attack booster. Would so wouldn't be... I oh, yeah. would I, that that was the intention. I was just out of the mint that did that, so I went oh, for no. the next best option. <laughs> gotcha. That yeah. Makes sense. No, it would it would it would preferably be speed because then I don't need to rely on tailwind as much to make sure I go first. That yeah, I agree. But still, uh, scary team and. Uh... Three good matches. Yeah, team makes sense, except I need to go and give Porygon something else to hold that isn't Life Orb. It's too squishy without the ability to boost its HP. And Excadrill, I don't think, is very uh, powerful in this environment. <laughs> or at least it is It is prone to being one-shot unless there are circumstances where I can make it go first more. Uh, so I have to kind of make sure it's uh, coming in immediately after the tame Tailwind. Otherwise, it's very easy to pop like a balloon. The the thing that I was laughing about earlier is uh, the Chandelier set on Gold Soul. Mm -hmm. My fourth move is Trick, right. and I'm Choice Specs. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. So, and it was realizing like, oh, I could do a t t the stupidest thing possible and Trick Choice Specs onto your Iron Crown t and get nothing. It <laughs> yeah. be like, this is just this. I just made my life worse. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, huh. Uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I mean, you know, uh, the fact that you kind of came 
without your without the your strongest heat and still can firmly beat me is i, I think a, a, I mean, a good hey. indicator of your skill you you definitely uh know how to theory craft a team very well keep in mind i this is like i came into this knowing what you were bringing like i didn't remember every terra type but this was like i very intentionally made a lot of choices to go like okay this can let me kill iron crown this can let me kill iron crown this will survive mm -hmm. iron crown and kill iron etc etc um because i i had the fear of god put in from uh from last time, I was like, oh, I, I can't, I can't just get expanding force to death, and I did, but only once out of three times. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I um, remember when I was initially doing like a training uh, for, for Fluffy Barrage, and uh, Mr. Gooseberry was like, oh, I'm going to use Luna Amari's team, uh, who was one of the previous competitors in the previous season, who had uh, Indeedy Hatterene as an opener, and Luna didn't do it on camera but so the the knowledge of it wasn't there that it could be done but just watching them both click expanding force turn one and just removing whatever the first two pokemon of four were and you're like oh oh that's disgusting <laughs> that's that's yeah. really mean um and it's kind of telling that in dd at least in dd f no longer gets expanding force i double checked oh, does it not? no they removed it they clearly realized how good that was um, but yeah, I mean, I love Armor Rouge. Uh, I mean, I love my boy Sarah Lynch just as much, if not more. But uh, Armor Rouge slow and not having to kind of rely... Not having to... I am a little sad that this, this combination doesn't have either of them on it. Um, if anything, I could probably replace uh, Claw Punk with Sarah Lynch. Because I'd still yeah. have the uh, Iron Head for Fairy types without losing too much. And it's a bit more, um, with the ability to heal itself, is a bit more uh, able to weather the storm a bit more. Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it was, uh, in I was glad that I could find a way of using, um, using expanding force in a way that uh that worked quite sensibly even though i i mean you know a lot of this is i can't use serenko machine outside of the terrarium i'm so sad <laughs> oh so we can tell them to stay put now can we yes if you click the left thumbstick they'll stay where they are oh. So I can now run around and it will stay stay put. Okay, hold on. So, so uh, them together. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah. get them to. Uh... There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sick. We, we got to get a good photo together. Mm -hmm. Um. Here, let. Try. Can you stand right next to me? Oh, sure. In the middle. Yeah. Uh. No. I always forget which button it is. It's this one. Oh well. Uh, Sticking my hand in front of your face. <laughs> okay, here. I can also take the photo. If you would prefer. Yeah. So let's see. Uh, now, gotta, let's see. Click that to change the angle. I thought not necessary, but, uh,. Gotta look like a bad bitch. <laughs> Gotta look like a bad bitch. Sad face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go. And let's see. Gotta get the horns in. Gotta get more caster in here. If you're stream after all. <laughs> No to the touch-ups, they all look awful. And yes, I'd like to share this. Alright, let's look at the photo. I had to move out of position to do it. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, good. Nice gaming, everybody. Alright, with uh, leaving it on that screen uh, while, we, while we go and wrap up, well, I'm finding uh, who we raid to, if anybody. Uh, yeah, what was your favorite favorite part of Scarvi as a whole? 
Oh man, my favorite part. Um, you know, uh, I think... I don't think I would have enjoyed this much if I didn't get to experience it with you. Being able to roll around and um, see each other and, you know, have, have the little interactions and all of that was a real, real delight. I think if I, if, you know, if I have to stick to things that are actually, um, I, <laughs> good, good job buddy ro running around this, um, there this is trundling. Mm -hmm. If I have to stick, if I have to stick to uh, things outside of that, probably like, I really liked the DLC in terms mm, of the, uh, mm -hmm. the double battles focus mm, and some of the extra challenges. Mm. I thought that was good and fun. Um, but I, I think, you know, the, the truth of the, my treasure is our friendship, Casper. Aww, babe. That's the truth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I, I, I agree. Uh, the Indigo Disc campaign was uh, really good uh, in terms of a uh, mechanical challenge. I mean, I still really love the conclusion of the story arc of main campaign. The entire AI professor arc. Yeah, true. Oh, God. <laughs> no, you're totally right. The AI professor arc was, like, genuinely quite cool and fun. Mm. I mean, like, you know, I, I, I continually be like, my my standards of uh, little kids shown in video game writing is not high. But when they go and make interesting swings and have characters that feel a bit more like people in the right places, I like appreciate that. And I think this is definitely, it was definitely building. Like I, I think uh, Sword and Shield's writing was a bit of a misstep, although it tried because um, it wanted to do a complicated thing. And then it was like, children shouldn't be doing this complicated thing. I'm like, mm -mm, you're missing the point of the genre. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but yeah, the, I, 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 I was uh, really interesting to see three separate kids who all feel estranged from school life in their own ways uh, find <laughs> a, a person that they can enjoy their school life in with you. And then we realize that there is a, a significant amount of trauma going on in one of them specifically. It was like, whoa. whoa. Um, and yeah, yeah, other other bits and pieces I liked was this was a really good play. This was a really good game to play blind, I think. Um, there yeah, are other Pokemon sure. games that you know I could I I I played um, Sword and Shield as a Nuzlocke blind when it came out, and enjoyed being able to catch Pokemon in the wild and make those active choices. But beyond that, it was like yeah, this was fine. Um, as, uh, even though I feel neutral on uh, the game being more of a sandbox and I would be entirely fine if the Gen 10 or whatever just didn't do that and became more of a linear adventure again, um, I did appreciate what it did for being a Nuzlocke and the idea of sneaking into areas slightly too strong for you to catch something ahead of schedule was a very interesting gameplay experience. Um, this definitely feels like a game... I, 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 when I talked to other people about um, the black and white Nuzlocke and was kind of like, man, I really liked that game, but playing through that game with a difficulty restriction really made me appreciate what the game had to offer to you mechanically and thinking about every single way you could wring out a sap of strength in a game that was heavily against you. And I don't think a Pokemon game is ever going to do that again, but I, I, I do wonder if uh, people now, now that uh, Scarlet and Violet is in the world, whether there is like a Nuzlocke route in this kind of big sandbox format that people really get. Um, you know, if you wiggle up here, if you backwards jump off these cliffs, you can go catch a level 30 thing. And if you don't do that, you will just die to the thing you run into. Huh. And the speedrun routing, too. I really have to wonder. Oh, the speedrun routing is pretty fascinating. Uh, if you've not seen any of the speedruns of it, um, what no. people will do is one of the three campaigns rather than all three. So there is uh, separate categories for doing Team Star, for doing oh, all the Titans, and for doing the gym. Just because all three take so long, um, each of the individual routes is uh, just under two hours, I would say, by themselves, which is a lot more bite-sized as, uh, as a campaign to do. People have talked about the idea of um, 
speed running the DLC, but I think it necessitates you beat the main campaign first. And that's such a time sink, it's not really um, re-runnable if you fail. Yeah, that's pretty brutal. Uh, it's, I think, if people got really good at speed running the entire main campaign, then maybe that'd be better. But still, that that is not a fast reset. Mm, mm. Considering there are people out there that play fucking uh, you, the the PS One Yu Gi Oh, which oh is God, fully luck memory. based and takes like four hours to do if you're lucky. Uh, then uh, uh, wait, but aren't gym badges the only ones that increase your level limit? Yes. <laughs> oh. Uh, that's wow. still that's that's uh that's for catching uh things so uh oh, the, okay so it, it does mean that your route has to include realizing there are things you can't catch if you're not doing the path of legends uh so yeah the the, the routes for team star and the routes for uh, titans are actually genuinely interesting to watch because they think about what they do and where they go in the game so differently and even the ones that are are not the titan roots will still beat cloth the cloth titan because it gives you the ability to dash on your bike uh and then other ones <laughs> just to make getting from a to b tolerable uh funny how most of them skip stuff like fly and find other ways to get to where they need to go um huh. mm -hmm. I also do want to say, in terms of what we what we liked about this game, mm -hmm. um, damn, yeah, Area Zero is really cool. It genuinely feels like a, it genuinely felt like kind of a tone shift, and really like with the music and the presentation, mm. just like wow, give it moment. weight <laughs> in a game that was quite light because everybody's on their summer holiday. Exactly. And then it's like, hey, we're going down into hell to meet my dead dad. It is. <laughs> definitely definitely a tone shift but it didn't feel like it was frivolous which was nice agreed even the terrapa ghost bit uh that process also was quite quite cool and shared that similar energy especially since um the teacher was just like yeah put your lives at risk <laughs> what do you yeah. think this is <laughs> was uh very funny less funny to die to the final boss and have to walk back but uh, uh yeah that was mm, bit of an eye roll but... yeah 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 so um what's next thursday <laughs> it doesn't have to be because sometimes we take a breather and do whatever uh, yeah I, that's an interesting question i wonder if there's like a fun little like one day thing that we could do it might be a bit of organizing excuse me on our parts but people did talk about four pay four player bp nonsense grinding nonsense in the in the blueberry stadium uh maybe uh having a having a four person call because we don't do wide collabs very often um <laughs> seeing if there's anybody in fluffy or whatever who would be around that evening uh to just kind of like dick around in the dome maybe hey uh when when people talk about um fighting games not being dead where uh if you have two people that's that's a match if you have three people that's uh winner stays on and if you have four people that's a mini bracket so hey uh we can we can see if there are there are scarvi players that we know that are around on a thursday night to go get grind some bp and then do a mini tournament i can actually revise yeah, my enough. team to something sensible <laughs> oh man then i'd have to like try and put together a team that's actually gonna be able to compete on the big stage instead of just go like oh what what's some dumb baloney i can bring out i or... mean i don't have nor am i especially willing to go and train any of the ru i mean i have the ruin one can't be fucked to train him i'm definitely not going to import a land of tea i don't have one so um it would pro i would probably be building something to fluffy barrage standards with more paradox mon than you would normally be allowed to have you know i will sure allow myself to <laughs> i mean like I'll, I'll be honest i think a uh that could be fun there is a part of me that's kind of like oh man i've been doing so much team building for this game it, it might be nice to uh to not to do that yeah take, take a bigger break and you know take take a swing like uh you know when we did, played that medley of uh pokemon side games 
Um, yeah, being... except not lumping me with the boring one, but, uh... Exactly, yeah, this, this time we will do caster a service instead of a disservice. I'll, I'll have a think if there's any medleys of games uh, that would be worth doing. We'll have a think about it, chat, is, yeah. is basically what we're saying. Pet, we're, pet we're... shop stream? Pet shop stream. <laughs> I, you know what I'm talking about. I, I, yeah, yeah. No, I know. I, I don't. I don't know whether I would find that very much fun. Know, it's I a very know. silly idea, but I don't know how well we can sustain that for an entire stream for. Uh, well, but yeah, we'll, 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 we'll think about it and get back to y'all. But in, in terms of what's Wug One uh, for, in terms of raiding, uh, Hasher is currently live playing Master Duel, another uh, Fluffy Barrage alumni champion of my season. Uh, let's all go say hi. And then uh, go take a quick break, then like go rest because it's almost uh, midnight my time. So we're going to go kick in that raid to uh, Hasha now. There we go. I have been your androgynous AI game show host from the future, Caster. I have been your amazing agender avian co-host, Rappy the Owl. This has been the Neocaster Twitch channel. And uh, see you anon, my dears. See you at the very least Sunday this week. Uh, for Chant of the Void Sea, Session 2. Have a good one, everyone. Peace.